everybody. This is Joy Wilson with Joy Wilson Inc. I'm doing a project today for Joy Claire Designs and I'm bringing you the Spring Rose uh, digital stamp. So to start my project, I started with the background and I'm using the diamond stencil from Gina Marie Des Designs and I'm blending uh, Vicki Boynton's uh, silver paste through that. And then uh, while that dries, I'm going to start coloring um, the images. So you'll see on the screen that I sized two of the florals a little bit smaller so that they would so that I could offset them. And I'm coloring those in the colors of R59, 29, 46, 24, and 22 for the florals. I'm only going to show the coloring for one flower because they're exactly the same and then for the greenery i used bg 99 and then i did a quick wash of yg01 um in the meantime while the coloring continues i just want to let you know that today uh january 27th the day of filming um there, we have a valentine day sale going on and we have a 20% off on all stamps that includes the clear stamps if you're interested so I just wanted to give you a heads up on that in the meantime I'm going to play some music until this finishes up Now that my coloring is finishing up, I'm adding some black uh, outlines around my uh, images just to clean them up from fuzzy cutting so they don't show up uh, so much on the black and silver background. And you're going to see here in a minute 
that I'm going to die cut that out with a um, mini sunline die from Gina Marie Designs. And you can find that in the shop. Um, <clears throat> also, uh, you'll find that I'm kind of fidgeting with my arrangement. And then I finally do pop up the uh, top layer on uh, on the red with uh, foam tape. And then I apply that to a mini slimline card base measuring three and a half by six and a half. And then um, I add the sentiment from the Spring Rose digital stamp set, uh, which I blocked off with my trimmer and then added hand-drawn corners with a multi-liner. And then I popped that up on the uh, front as well. And then for my final steps, I'm just making sure everything's adhered down. I'm using a um, acrylic block just to make sure all the corners are coming down. So that pretty much wraps up my project. Um, I'd really appreciate it if you would like and subscribe and for more inspiration you can uh, check out the Joy Claire Designs website as well as my own joywilsoninc.com. Thank you.